Hi guys, my name is Jemmy. Hi guys, my name is Afi. And today we're going to be telling you what we read in the Make X 2020 Starter Smart Links Technical Guide. Um, we're not going to be full on detail. We're going to do that in another video. What we're going to be doing today is we're going to give you like a brief overview of what it just said. So, first of all, there's the arena of the Make X 2020 robot competition. Well, the the mat is 2440 by 2440 millimeters and the similarities of it from the 2019's map is because it has um, an auto map and a manual map and it also has auto independent missions auto alliance missions and the manual mission yep so those are the similarities of what it is the missions look different though don't you think yeah yeah it looks pretty different and here we're going to be explaining the single match flow chart. This flow chart is basically what we do inside the competition itself. So first off, we have the preparation, which is where we um, build our bot and construct our code. Then when they call our name for us to like prepare for the match, then we will go into the inspection where they will check your weight and your bot size if it's correct and it meets the requirement after that they if you fail you will have to modify your robot according to the requirements then you go in preparation again and you go in inspection once you pass then you go into waiting which is waiting at the mat with your um alliance then after that the referee will confirm team presence which means is everybody here is everybody ready and then if once you said you're ready then we'll confirm alliance mission captain which basically is the alliance captain will stop the time when all the missions are finished and you think that it's necessary to stop the time right now after that they will you will have to rock paper scissors with your alliance to get um the card for which your mat is going to be like now this is not like playing rock paper scissors normally it's um, rock paper scissors and then the winner gets to choose the card it's just and the card is random too so it depends on luck what your what mission you're gonna get and after you check the props in the arena of the mat then you can it starts you click turn on your robot and then you attempt your automatic missions after the automatic missions end then you go in the preparation stage which is moving your bot to the other manual stage after that you will the scoring of the automatic mission will start checking and then you will test your bluetooth controller which they'll give you 30 seconds for you to test after you connected your bot with your bluetooth controller the manual stage will start then you'll attempt to start the manual stage if your team does like bad and then you in your automatic stage and you don't have that much time left you can just raise your hand for the alliance captain can raise their hand and then you can just tell her to stop to the time. But if you attempted the manual mission, like like actually did it, and after it ends, then it will stop all the operations, which means everything will stop. And then those um sc check the scores of your manual stage. Then you'll shut down your robot, and then team confirm scoring, which means that the team has to the team captain of each, both teams need to um get their signature and like sign it so that we know um what score it is if something's wrong you tell the judge or the referee that this is wrong and i think you need to calculate it again because if something's wrong and you get let's point it's not um good for your team so you get to do the math by yourself too then after you're done confirming your score then the single match will end now the entire match will last for only 240 seconds, which is four minutes. Um, it's different from 2019 because all the match is 240 seconds, which is because um, it doesn't have like a limit anymore. Cause like last time it had a limit on only two minutes and 30 seconds for automatic stage and one minute and 30 seconds for manual stage. But this time it's 240 for all. So automatic stage you can spend the, your whole 240 seconds or 
you can finish your automatic stage first and then you go to manual stage which is you have the leftover time from the automatic stage that you can complete it if you have like 10 seconds and you know you can't do anything then just raise your hand the autom the alliance captain will raise their hand and then you can stop the time to get a better like time score so yeah the whole match will last for 240 seconds and the preparation stage is where um where we like connect our bot to the bluetooth controller after that the let's us explain about the mat of 2020 where the placements of each mission are so i1 is m1 and m2 i2 is m3 and m4 i3 is m5 and s is starting area so there's only one starting area this time and then a1 is m6 m7 and A2 is M8 and M9. Yep, so that is the automatic stage. And now let's look at the manual stage. Okay, so A3 is the whole map of M10, which is manual. S is starting area. C is the containing area. P is the placing area. And L is a loading area. And now what you can do in this map is that the placing area will contain 25 white EVA balls which you can shoot into the containing area which is like a little hoop it's not like um was it six blocks like this you it's like a little container for you guys to shoot the ball in here the loading area what it can do is that you can get your balls into the loading area your bot into the loading area then your observers can get the balls and put it inside your bot then your bot can shoot um into the container now the missions of each like now the mission for make x 2020 is based on smart links and i think that you it's basically mostly based on people no not people i mean our bots throwing the ball over or onto the ground of any mat if you throw it into the manual area you will get extra points if you like throw it inside to the containing area so first let me explain so the balls you have you can toss it onto the menu area and then you'll get points then you can get the ball inside the menu area throw it inside the container and you'll still get extra points so if you hit this ball onto the ground in the automatic stage you will also still get some points and m1 m2 M3 and M4, they're all like the same style and you need to throw it inside the manual area. Now, what I'm thinking is that they'll need to switch, um, not switch, I mean pick random of this when you're doing your rock, paper, scissors thing in the beginning. So they'll switch their random which one it is. So it's not gonna you have to do all of it. It's gonna just random which one you're gonna have to do and in here n05 we'll identify our obstacles this is basically um identifying if this is a cylinder then what you need to do is you need to go around it and don't knock it out of its circle or let it fall down that's the cylinder now the cube the dual cubes is basically you need to knock the top one off onto the ground and you'll get the point for that while this one you need to completely avoid it now M06 community data inspection is basically the same thing as M1 to M4. Just get the ball and throw it inside the manual stage. But if it lands inside the automatic stage, you'll still get the points, but you won't get like the whole point. So yeah, that's M6 and M4. No, M7. And now M8 is the unlocked base station this is for that little place that my sister just said um it's the shortened version of m9 which is the unlock ele elevated base station which is a little higher than m08 so you can knock the ball more easily off and now m10 city data collection is basically um throwing these balls into the container which is the manual stage 
And as I said earlier, you can get all these balls into the manual area and throw them inside the container. The red ball is 20 points, the blue ball is 20 points, the green ball is also 20 points, and the big yellow ball is 30 points. Now the white balls in the manual area is only 10 points. Now the dual cubes is 20 points and red and blue cylinder is 20 points. That's Make X 2020 Technical Guide and see you later. Bye. Bye. Also, if you want to get updated on the movement of Make X, then be sure to click subscribe and click the notification bell.